on ball forward here in Swindon. They've got men inside the penalty area. Painter makes the run. And it's Painter. Oh, neat finish. 1-0. Just four minutes on the clock. Billy Painter opening the scoring for Swindon. Wonderful move. They were arriving inside the penalty area. Painter near post. Then no chance. Another opportunity now for Swindon. And another good ball in. And this time it's Craig Easton. Swindon have doubled their advantage just 23 minutes in. Easton it was arriving unmarked. Another cross from the left-hand side. Nobody near Easton. And no chance for Glennon. No smiles on the Swindon bench. Massive pump forward. Swindon coming forward once again here. And the space on the right-hand side for Easton once again. It's his second. It's Swindon's third. And we're fairly close to half-time, just 31 minutes on the clock. And it's Swindon 3, Huddersfield 0. Swindon supporters very, very happy. It's easy at the moment for the home team. What have Huddersfield got as they look to get back into this match? That's a poor challenge from Eiffel on Collins, and it's a penalty. Penalty awarded contact between the two players and that's a easy take for Phil Jevons to reduce the deficit to 3-1 as you like sending the keeper the wrong way the half time score 50-50 ball oh now then what is the referee going to do now because Peacock was rather late there on uh, Melvin Kamara and this could be a red, it is, straight red, Peacock sent off, just past the hour mark, 50-50, both players went for it, and Peacock was late and high, and he's been given his marching orders. Peacock applauds the supporters of Swindon, but he's off, and maybe a chance now for Huddersfield. That's a decent looking ball in, oh, and off the line, but surely a hand was used. Well, the ball's in the back of the net, I think the referee... He's going to give the penalty here. Let's see what he does first of all, though, to Billy Painter, who has received a second yellow and therefore a red. Painter is off. Swindon are down to nine. And Huddersfield will have a penalty to reduce it to three to drama here at the county ground. And it was goal bounds. The ball ended up in the back of the net. But what about the penalty? It will be Jevons again to step up. Painter is off. It's Jevons, it's 3-2, and there's still hope for Huddersfield Town. 13 minutes remaining at the county ground. Can they come back from 3-0 down to 3-3? It would be some story. What's the delivery like here? It's towards Andy Booth with a header, tipped over by Phil Smith. That was so close to 3-3. Final score, though, 3-2 to Swindon.